is Joe Biden cheating to win presidency? That's a big question people around the world are asking, not even just in America. And my short answer to you is yes. And here's the reason. So right now, Joe Biden's at 264 points and Trump is at 214. It's 270 to win. Obviously, it looks like someone's going to win, you know, someone with a certain more points. But there's some there's some shady things going around, like the fact that uh, Joe Biden actually had enough votes in Michigan to literally surpass the fucking state's population. Now, might just be me. I know it's not like two people, five people, 40 fucking thousand more people, 40,000 more votes than voters in Michigan. Care to explain that? Oh, you can't? Yeah, neither can I. You know that? I can't explain that bullshit either. So, um, I think he's cheating. He's a scumbag. Um, he honestly should be a proud president anyway. But, that's not, you think, you think your boy A's is going to come here with one piece of evidence? No, bro, I don't roll like that. But, Joe F Joe, sleepy Joe, <laughs> sleepy Joe, sleepy Joe, him goddamn self, gained a total of a hundred and twenty-eight thousand new votes. Great, great job, Joe. But here's one shady thing: in the time span he gained that hundred twenty-eight thousand votes, not one other person gained more votes. Which you might seem it sketchy, because it is. Uh, what's it called? Donald Trump stayed at two point two million. Uh, well, if you if you want exact, all right, sorry, the audio cut out here. But basically, what I was trying to say is Donald Trump, in that span of time, gained no no votes. Went from uh, two million two hundred thousand nine hundred two votes to two million two hundred thousand nine hundred two votes. Joe Biden went from one point nine uh one point nine nine two million to two point one three million. Wow, and then. The guy, the other Joe, stayed the same. Howie Hawkins stayed the same. And Don Blankenship stayed the same. That's all I was trying to say. Audio cut out. It corrupted. None of it saved. Just wanted to say that. Uh, yeah. So, back to the video. Heard of. And the whole Michigan thing. It's not a debate. It's a goddamn fact. He cheated. There's no possible way that... There can be more of voters. There can be more, more votes than voters. It's unheard of. It's not possible. There's not... The math doesn't add up. It's simple math. And people even fucking make memes. It's like... The fucking Star Wars guy. Going... It's like the Clone Wars. He goes, Magnificent, aren't they? Over a hundred thousand fraud ballots. It's true! It's true. They're fraud. He's committing fraud. A federal crime. People are even making memes like Sleepy Joe when he finds out uh, there's enough votes in Michigan to literally surpass the state's population. Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, someone's got to wake his fucking cheating ass up and be like, someone's gonna fucking wake up Joe Biden and be like, yo, bro, you won president. Because cause he cheated. Because he cheated, you know? If there was no fraud, I'm very confident to say that Donald Trump would have. Alright, I know this video is turning out really shitty because, uh, my audio keeps corrupting and my video keeps freezing. But anyway, uh, what I was supposed to say was, both Michigan and Wisconsin had vertical lines where Joe Biden's votes were injected in. What the hell? That's not legit. Bro, that's a 90 degree angle. Alright, get, let's get back to this, bro. God, mother- God, mother- Numbers surpassed with a straight line right on screen right now straight ass line okay and the Bra brown and kenosha is still fucking counting there that's also counting and also uh over 130,000 ballots have been oh i just scored it myself but 130,000 goddamn ballots at least have been found in a lake and a river sorry what what is that and i guarantee you most of them are donald trump it can't be proven, because they're water damaged, but how else would Joe Biden get that much of a lead? I mean, 
obviously we have enough proof to to convict him of voting fraud cuz I mean even the one piece of evidence of Michigan there's not enough people in Michigan my back I don't know shit's freezing but anyway people are literally saying oh yeah Trump would have never won anyway it's proven it's proven <laughs> shut up it's literally proven by numbers which the people that are saying that the fucking hardcore Biden supporters don't want to end racism because, like, I don't know, because he says he's going to end racism. Meanwhile, it's impossible. You can't just end racism. You can't just put an end to racism. You can't just say, no, don't do this, man. It's like saying, oh, yeah, I'm going to put an end to murders. Like, bro, you can't do that. It's fucking, it's not how shit works, man. But, yeah. Can't just say he wasn't gonna win when numbers would have shown that without those fake fucking votes that people have even found. What about the what about the fucking fake votes that no one found? Huh? Then what are people gonna say? This is just a, this is the one that the people have fucking looked at. This is just the one that people have found so far. What about that bullshit when Probably most of his fucking votes were that. But that's California, because they're a bunch of libtards. <laughs> this fuck. This goddamn... Click, click. Alright, please don't click off the video yet. It's actually really important. One of my main claims that I forgot to talk about in the video. But, literally, this is on the news. Uh, Detroit voter uh, roll lawsuit filed by the Public Interest Legal Foundation. Let me just tell you a couple facts that they stated. So, 4,788 duplicate registrations were put in. 3,000, or, sorry, 32,519 uh, more registered voters than eligible voters. Uh, 2,503 dead people voted and registered. And one voter was born in 1823. Yeah, thanks for watching. Um, ooh. That's a rough one.